Hello. Um, I'm filming this video back back to back with my last video, which was the ghost in Paraconch video. Um, today's is not about ghost or in para or anything ghost related. It is actually by a band I don't know much about. Um, I just got into them not too long ago, like a few days ago. Um, oop. And, um, and yes, I, I don't really know much about them, so don't, like, come at me for not knowing much about them. Um, like I said, I just got into their music, and so far I think they're really good. And this is the Target exclusive to, I believe, their latest album, correct me if I'm wrong, from 2021. It is Let the Bad Times Roll by The Offspring. So I haven't even opened it yet because I wanted to wait until I made this video. Sorry for the glare. But then this is the back. Which I honestly, I'm gonna be honest. This is probably one of the best album covers I've seen. And my favorite album cover of all time is Opus Abominus by Ghost. And um, Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge by My Chemical Romance and Black Parade by My Chemical Romance. And I love um, the album cover for In Utero by Nirvana, which I still need on vinyl. And I love the album cover for Live Through This by Hole. And, um... Oh, I'm trying to think of other ones I really love at the moment, but none are coming at the top of my head. But this is definitely up there with them. I love the detail to it. I I just love how there's like multiple hands, arms, and I love the bag. And I'm being honest, I just noticed the $100 bill right there. I honestly just noticed that. Um, but yeah, this is, this is a beautiful beautiful album cover and back cover um I don't know what the CD looks like but I'm hoping it looks like this as well with the back cover but this is not a black standard final this is the Target exclusive limited edition um like I said I haven't opened it yet I don't know if I'm keeping the sticker I usually have a struggle with Target stickers um I tried taking the Target sticker off my Impera but that did not go well um, so, um, yeah. I'm trying to peel it right now, but it's not, it's not, it's not gonna peel. I've only, I only have success with Urban Outfitter stickers. Um, and you're, if you're wondering why, why are you peeling the sticker off, I put these in their own sleeves that I've gotten at Walmart. And, um, I put the stickers on the sleeves, but, um, Target clearly does not like me taking their stickers off because every time I do, it does not go very well. I did get the Impera one off, I will admit. However, the back's not sticky. It ripped. Like, the stick part, the sticky part of it stayed on. <laughs> so I have to figure out a way of making it look good whenever I put it on the sleeve. But I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do that. I don't know if I'm going to use glue, which would not be a good idea. And I'm not sure. Sorry, hiccups. And I'm sure if I'm not. I, I don't know if I'm going to use, like, clear tape. I, I honestly don't know. I have the sticker located somewhere on one of my shelves. But yeah, if you can, like, hear my nail right now. Well, I don't really have nails. But it is not going very well. However, we're just going to open this up. Um, but yeah, so this is what it looks like. This is the only one that the Target I went to had, um, so yeah, let's just open it up. But, um, I listened to this album. I love it. It is a really good album. If you want to know my favorite song from it, before we, like, really dive into it, my favorite song off of it, only because it has, like, a funny vibe to it, is We Never Have Sex Anymore. Um, I really, I, when I say funny vibe, like, some of the instruments that they're using and whatnot gives off like a silly like kind of vibe if you don't know what i mean i it's i have a hard time explaining it i'm having a hard time explaining it but um but yeah let's just you know open this up um i can try getting the sticker off later now that it's not on the album i don't know how well that's gonna work though i've had success with that was uh, with my urban outfitters one but like i said 
I Target doesn't like when I take off their stickers apparently. But I'm very excited to see what this looks like because I don't have a yellow vinyl. Well actually that's a lie. I kind of do. It's more of a peach though. It's for Razzmatazz by I don't know how but they found me. There's yellow in it. Um, but it's called Peach Swirl. So I'll, I'll st I guess I can count as a yellow vinyl. But like, a, like other than that, I mostly have blue vinyls and pink kind of vinyls. And this is not coming off that great. And I have, uh, and I have, um, let's try it this way. Sorry if I'm taking forever. I'm very tired right now. So opening these right now is like asking, it's like asking a two year old to figure out a Sudoku puzzle. Um, oh, there we go. Um. But, yeah, I really don't own any, like, yellow vinyls besides that one, if you want to count it. I'll have to make a video on it someday, because it is a beautiful vinyl, the Rasmus has. But here it is, with no seal to it and no sticker. Um, like I said, it is such a beautiful, beautiful fucking album cover. And I am really excited to- oh my god, it's a gatefold! Holy shit, it is a fucking gatefold! This is gorgeous. The artwork in here is gorgeous. I didn't think it was a gatefold. <laughs> oh, I love that. The one image in here I love. It's a it's a girl with clown makeup and a, with a crown and like her holding a gun. Don't know what kind of gun it is. Um I'm sure if I showed my boyfriend, he would he would know. Um but this is the gatefold. Like holy shit. I don't have much room to like get it all in because right here is a door. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm sure if I showed my boyfriend that gun, he'll probably tell me what gun it is. Because I couldn't tell you I am not into guns. <laughs> um, but let's see the vinyl. I'm so fucking excited. Um, okay, okay, okay. So, oh, okay, let's not damage this. Let's see. Which way does it? Okay, so this is the... Okay, before I go in, this is the fucking... This is beautiful. I love this. I love that. With the, the hand, with the snake, with the rose. I fucking love that. I love this. I love this with the pill and the, and the syringe. I love that. I love this. This is gorgeous. Now the real question is, is the vinyl gorgeous? Oh my god, the real the, the the real answer is yes. Yes it is. Holy shit. Oh, it is bright. Oh my god. Holy shit, the camera does not do its justice. Holy hell. It's, it's not transparent. I thought it was, It's but it's not. Like, I'm holding it up to things, and it's not transparent. I thought it was originally, but no. The camera does not do its justice. This is gorgeous. I love the, um, I love the, ain't the skeleton angel. That is, it's the same on both sides, but this is gorgeous. Oh my, this is cool. It's like, it's it's really bright. I wouldn't say neon bright, but it, it, but this is bright. This is bright. This is gorgeous. Just as a solid color, this is gorgeous. And it's very light. Like, it's, it's very light. But it is fucking gorgeous. I'm so glad I picked this up. I'm so glad I did. Because this is breathtaking. And I love the sleeve it comes in. It does not just come in an ordinary paper sleeve so this just shows I do not need to give it its own sleeve because <laughs> I this is gorgeous this is so gorgeous it's not gonna its own protective sleeve this is the sleeve <laughs> but this is gorgeous I oh my god I just noticed this too the vinyl that is so beautiful I would get a tattoo of this but that's probably not gonna be anytime soon because I am getting two tattoos very soon one Thursday and one in August um, but, yeah, that is, 
This is beautiful. This is so beautiful. And what it looks like when it's just peeking out. Like, that is beautiful. Hell yeah, dude. This is gorgeous as fuck. Do I think, as both being target exclusives, do I think it beats Coral mm, for Impera? No, um, I don't really think it does. Because I love the Coral. Um, and I also, I want to say I'm very, I apologize for seeming down and tired in that last video and like we're talking very quiet um like i said i've been depressed um there's a lot going on in my life and um i'm very tired at the moment i just had some something to drink so that's what kind of has me like more energetic so i'm very sorry about my last video of me being like down i'm just you know going through a lot right now and um hopefully things get better for me and better for everyone else out there in the world who is struggling with things but yeah i didn't think this would be a gatefold however it surprised me this is gorgeous i have to say this is so gorgeous it is a breathtaking album itself with the beautiful songs on it like i said my favorite is we don't have sex anymore it is it's got that funny vibe to it in my opinion just with how like they the, how the music plays out but yeah this is gorgeous this is amazing i have to get into the offspring even more i feel like in the beginning of the video i said set it off i feel like i did i'll have to rewatch it and if i did i apologize i'm very fucking tired right now but um but yeah this is breathtaking and i kind of like how they have like a bomb here that's cool like this is gorgeous like this is gorgeous i'm sure there's people out there i have to now look into it I have tattoos of these things because i would not be surprised this is amazing like i said i give this album like a 9 out of 10 it is such a good album I definitely recommend it to everybody um, who's into rock and, you know, and who's into that kind of music. But yeah, that's about it with this video. Um, um, that and Coral um, and Par Impera by Ghost have been my two recent vinyls recently. I haven't gotten really anything new other than them two recently. I'm hoping to get another Opus Epominus, um very soon. If you're wondering which variation, I really want, really, 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 really want either the blue and orange swirl, because I, like, love kind of swirl vinyls, or the Record Store Day exclusive half clear, half blue, because that just looks so, so gorgeous, and I have, and I have a obsession with blue vinyls, um... But yeah, that's about it. Um, I'm, again, I'm sorry with my last video if I seemed down, not really energetic. I, again, like I said, I'm very, very tired right now. It is midnight where I live. Um, six minutes past midnight where I live and um, I'm depressed right now. But yeah, um, I also wanted to say, and I'm very still surprised with myself that I did this and... If anyone that I know personally watches these, which I tell, um, um, knows, knows me, I'm not into TikTok. I never been. I was a musically person and then they got rid of it and I was like, well, shit. I'm not into like that kind of stuff. However, I downloaded it and it's, it's okay. I downloaded it because I, I downloaded it because, um, with the tattoo I'm getting Thursday, I wanted to film my little adventure of getting my first tattoo ever, and I thought TikTok would probably be the best solution because how the editing works and how I want it, and I was like thinking of it, and I was like, as much as I don't want to, I guess I'll use TikTok to do it. So I'm very excited. If you want to know my TikTok, I believe the title of my username is Mysterious Goth. I think if it's not. I'll correct myself in the description. Um, 
you can tell I'm never really on it. I just have it downloaded for Thursday in my August 13th appointment. But, um, yeah, that's about it. Like I said, apologies for my last video, how down I seemed and how, like, bleh, zombie like I was. I, I guess, I, again, I'm just, you know, you, you, I, I've said it a lot, but, you know. But, yeah, that's about it. Um, I think, but, yeah. But I think everyone should go check this album out. It is gorgeous. It is, you have this in your collection, the limited edition. I'm probably going to look up more variants because if this is, if this is beautiful, I like to see what the other variants look like. Um, but yeah, I think this is the latest. I believe it came out in 2021. And if I am completely wrong, please do me the honors and correct me in the comments. Um, like I said, I just got into them, so I don't know much don't don't know much about them so but hopefully that will change over time but yeah um but like i said yeah go check this out it is amazing and we're gonna put it back here until i get its own little slip and i think it, i think the best thing is is that it is a pain in the dick to get gatefolds in its own like sleeve because how thick like having like a gatefold like i would pull example but they're all the way over there like how thick the vinyl can be and it not fitting but i'm re i really love how this one's like flat like it will be it will easily slide in that's why i'm shocked this is a gatefold because usually you can tell when it's a gatefold without opening it without opening the sleeve but yeah that, that's about it with my video i um hope you enjoyed it and i hope you have a great day evening night morning wherever the fuck you live i hope you're enjoying your day and don't let anyone tell you who you can or can't be and i hope everyone who's watching this is doing okay mentally and physically and i hope you do something that makes you smile today and yeah so thank you for watching i'm gonna go to bed <laughs> uh well first i'm gonna go watch ink master then i'm gonna go to bed <laughs> i've fallen asleep to it but yeah, thank you so much, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Bye!